What's going on, everybody? It's Nails with the Countdown. Florida's known for having amazing wildlife, and there are many places where you can get close to some incredible animals. So we're counting them down. Here we go. At number five, we head to Walt Disney World's largest park, Animal Kingdom. The Gorilla Falls Exploration Trail and the Maharaja Jungle Track take you through wild animal habitats. There's also fun shows like the new Up, a great bird adventure, or you can say Jumbo and go on a Kilimanjaro safari for an unforgettable experience. You can find our number four destination nestled in a protected natural wetland. The Central Florida Zoo and Botanical Gardens in Sanford has animals from all around the world. You can feed giraffes or go behind the scenes with Indian rhinos. At number three, Discovery Cove is a place where you can interact with bottlenose dolphins, feed tropical birds, play inches from a family of otters, and even walk on the Grand Reef floor all in one day. Between adventures, recharge in a relaxing cabana with unlimited island fare and refreshments. You'll feel like you stepped into the wilderness when you visit our second choice. The Back to Nature Refuge is a nonprofit organization dedicated to rescuing and rehabilitating injured and orphaned native animals. They have resident ambassadors that include lemurs and this foxy guy. Enjoy their wildlife walk for only a $5 donation. Now the moment we've all been waiting for, our number one spot, Wild Florida in Keenansville. The park is home to a number of animals that make up the Florida Everglades ecosystem and so much more. Just ask our girl Esty, who definitely had some wild experiences during her visit. It's Esty with IC Florida here at Wild Florida. And yes, it lives up to its name. It's so wild. I'm in a buggy. I'm gonna go see alligators, animals, birdies, try amazing food. I hear they have amazing smoothies as well so I can cool off. And the best part, I'm getting in an Arabo. Yes, I can't wait. It's Wild Florida with Icy Florida. Gators, frog legs, cows, oh my. We're taking a trip back in time to the way Florida used to be. Away from the hustle and bustle of city life, taking us on our journey is my new friend Sam, who literally built this place with his bare hands. This dock, I'm kind of proud of it because I built it. So you, you in one day you dug 21 and you posts. placed. Yeah. Sam says one of the best things about Wild Florida is getting up close and personal to nature. And now it's my turn. I'm ready to hop in on an airboat and take a ride through the swamp. Normally what we do is we follow the wildlife. We, we kind of try to keep track of where we've been seeing gators and different birds and animals and stuff. And uh, we'll stop and tell them about the animals, tell them about the lakes and the canals. And this lake that we're sitting on is called Lake Cypress. This is 4,100 acres of all fresh water. And the canals go to different lakes. There's a whole series of these lakes that are connected to each other. And they go from right here in central Florida, which is the headwaters to the Everglades, all the way to south Florida to the Everglades. And you can take a boat from right here all the way through the ocean. Super awesome. I just saw a ton of animals. Now it's time to take a closer look. Let's see what puts the wild in wild Florida in their 13-acre nature park. Probably one of the most popular things we have here are sloths. And we've, for some reason, out here in the middle of nowhere, become a sloth destination. There's not very many places in the world where you can actually uh, touch, hold, feed a sloth. As you come through this park, we want you to make a connection with animals in general, whether it's a native Florida or an exotic animal. Hopefully something says, wow, I can't believe that lemur, that sloth, that monkey was so cool. And when you go home, you want to get involved and, and, and do something to help yeah, conserve. Yep. To end our day, Sam brought me to Wild Florida's swamp famous Chomp House Grill. One of probably our most popular platter that we offer here is our swamp platter. And we've got catfish, frog legs, and gator tail. Did he just say frog legs? So how do I eat frog legs? Like I literally just like chicken? Just like chicken. Right, the sauce? Chicken. Oh my God, that's really good. Yeah. Wild Florida. If you're looking to get away, learn about animals, and eat some great food, you've got to check out this hidden gem. Inside Central Florida, your source for events, theme park news, local eats, and more, streaming 24-7 on the WFTV Now app on your TV.